Hello there, it's Sharon, your guitar guide, helping you find your sound, and today I want to show you how to play the melody of a song, and that's coming up. showing up at your guitar guide the channel where i'm going to help you find your sound with guitar lessons music and gear reviews if this is your first time here have a look around if you like what you see consider subscribing for more guitar tips and tricks and for all of you who have already subscribed thank you very much today i have this song that i've played for a long long time and i want to show you the chords in it but then also i had to pick out the melody and when you're starting out it's great to learn how to strum chords. We've got C we're going to play. F. G. The thing is, when you're singing and playing chords, then someone can recognize the song because you're basically singing the melody of the song. But, if you're just strumming away, and that just sounds like I'm playing some chords. So that's where a melody comes in. You just want to do an instrumental with no singing. So on this one, everyone's heard this song. We know that this song is in the key of C. So we're going to play chords in the song are C, F, and G. And really, to I'll show you how to play the melody and the chords at the same time, but to learn how to play the melody, it takes ear training, which takes listening to a lot of music and sitting there and figuring out little bits and pieces on your guitar as you go along and the more you do this and listen your ear becomes used to the different sounds and you automatically know where to go to make that sound so for today we're going to start on c and we're picking the bass C note, which is the third fret of the A string, the fifth string. Then we're going to play, which is picking that C note again, open D string, the fourth string, second fret of the D string, third fret of the D string and we're playing the F chord to play the F place your first finger of the first two strings you're barring it there second finger is on the third string the G string and your third finger is on the D string the fourth string you're gonna strum from the fourth string down so we've got strum the C, then we're going back up to the C, so 
So I'm going to go from the F. I'm going to pick the 3rd fret or the bass note of the F. 3rd fret of the D string. 2nd fret of the D string. Open D string. Back to the C. So it's F That's pretty easy. It's just back and forth. And then we go C, pick the C twice, the third fret of the A string. Open D string, second fret of the D string, pick that twice, open D string. C, F, then it's C, open D, second fret of the D, second fret of the A, back to the C. So you can see, if I'm just strumming away, you didn't know what song I was playing. You just know I was playing a C, F, and G. We can also play the famous bass line right here. So to play that we're gonna play which is third fret of the E string. 3rd fret of the E, open A, and 3rd fret of the A string. And we're going to stop the ringing of the notes with this part of our hand, which would be the same as muting the strings. So we're going to so it's E, well actually it's a G note, but it's the third fret of the E string, open the A string, so after you hit the A string, you stop it, and then hit the A string again, open A string, when I say hit the A string, we're on the third fret of the A string. Open A string, back to the third fret of the E string, open A string, third fret of the E string, open A string, third fret of the A string, so it's open A string. Open A string, then third fret of the A string, then it's we're on the D string, second fret. 
So it's two open two on the second fret of the D. So it's two open two, two open three of the A string. So that it's all on the D string. Two open two, two open A, third fret of the A string. Pick that twice. Second fret of the A string. Back to the third fret of the A string. So it's. It's all about timing on this because you got to really first learn it and then you can get the timing on it. It's, it's fun to play. So here's from the beginning. If you like this lesson, I have two free goodies over at yourguitarguide.com. The first thing is the tab for this song, so it'll help you learn how to play it. And the second thing is, is how to play songs and sing at the same time. And the information in that free lesson will also help you pick out a melody and sing at the same time. I'll leave a link in the description for those goodies. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson. If you have, can you give it a thumbs up? Don't forget to leave me a comment and be sure and watch that video next.